Welcome back to another video review. Today we're going to be taking a closer look at the Kinst Napa Leather Slim Zippered Coin Wallet Card Holder. So I know that's a long name for it, but in short, um, it's a slim wallet design. Um, so you can carry your basics because in today's uh, society, basically we just, we don't really carry cash. I know I don't. Um, I may carry like a couple coins with me for coffees and stuff. But for the most part, I just carry my credit cards and my ID um, for my job, and that's pretty much it. So this is nice and small and slender, which we'll see in a little bit. Uh, I bought it off of Amazon for $16.99 while a lightning sale, and that was Canadian. Uh, usually they're $21.99 Canadian, so I bought it also because it was on a deal. And then also, this is an updated version of their regular slim line of wallets. All right, so just to uh, show, this is the wallet I was using in the past. Uh, this is the Condor Volt Trifold. Um, decent wallet. Did everything I needed it to do. Although the plastic on it right here for the window is breaking. And uh, the primary reasons why I bought this also was for the zippered pocket and for the lanyard. Um, just in case while I'm working uh, on the job site, if I have my ID presented on front of me, it could be. So that's why I bought this wallet. But as you can see, pretty thick, made out of Kadura. So anyways, let's take a closer look at the new wallet that I got here. I've been using this for a couple weeks, so I've tested it, played around with it. I just want to show how it came packaged. So it comes in this uh, plastic sleeve here. So a lot of way, open that up, you get a box. And inside you get an accessory pack and then the wallet itself. So we don't need this stuff anymore. All right, so in the accessory pack, you get a lanyard and a keychain. And that was the primary reason why I bought this, because I usually don't review items like this, but it was so that I could show um, the lanyard on it and stuff, and that this was an updated version, and this would be useful for people such as myself. I do security, so sometimes we have to have our ID presented on the front of us. So this has that ability. And also I like to carry uh, change with me sometimes for coffees. So that's why I wanted a zipper pocket instead of just an opened pocket. Uh, the keychain itself, I can say right now that uh, this is something that I would not use as part of this kit. Uh, these steel chains, they're not good. They'll break. And for example, um, when I was playing around with it, and showing the strength of it uh, before doing this video um, I was pulling on it and it broke and I just fixed it just to show for the video of what you get but it does break so uh, I would probably rip this whole chain off and just use the key ring off of it and keep that all right so I'm just gonna throw that to the side here okay so we got the lanyard that's the main piece I wanted with it and then we got the wallet as you can see right here, lanyard loop, zippered pocket on the side here. Uh, inside the wallet, when it comes to you, you get a business card from them and just a white cardboard card just for the display window. Uh, throw that to the side. And then on the card, basically has their information for their website, how to support them, how to contact them on Instagram and such. You can email them. All right. So, that to the side. All right, so um, one of the main features of these type of wallets from Kins is the RFID uh, secure technology in it. It's got some special material in between each layer so that uh, your cards are protected from the RFID scanners and readers. Uh, it comes with uh, seven slots. Um, basically one slot is for your ID with the window and then six just regular slots here. So windowed one, one, two, three, four, five, and then six. That's how they usually label it. It is seven pockets. I've found that you can double layer your cards in these two pockets. In this one, it's a little bit tight because you also have this back one and you're doing four anyways. But you can do four on this side as well with something slim in this side. Uh, Size-wise, comparative to my old wallet, you can see a lot slimmer. 
And basically when this is full, I'll show that it's the same size as this wallet. It's a lot smaller. Uh, you can fit this in your front pocket if you wish, which I've done with my shorts. And then, uh, interesting enough, when I'm wearing this one in my back pocket, sometimes I have to double check to make sure I brought my wallet because it is very slim and light. This wallet here, the Condor one, is 90 grams empty. This one, once I fill it with everything, which I'll show in a little bit, into it, is 97 grams total. So a lot of weight is uh, lighter on this one compared to this. All right, so I'm just gonna pause here and then I'm gonna fill this wallet with uh, some cards and stuff in it and I'll be right back. All right, so I've got the wallet all filled up now. So basically just to show here, I've got uh, my debit card and then two credit cards. And in this pocket right here, I've got one of those fold-up knives. Uh, just in case of emergency, I have something on me that uh, I can cut if I need to. Like a seatbelt or whatever. So that fits in there it's perfectly. In the middle pocket, I've got my Harvey's and A&W coupons I usually carry with me because they always have deals. A little bit of change uh, just in case I'm at an event or such doing my job. Um, usually they don't have debit machines there to get food, so need a little bit of cash to be able to get some food if I'm hungry and some change for some coffee. And as you can see, that all fits in there perfectly. Zipper it up, so I'm not gonna lose my change. On this side, I just got a couple of my other extra certifications for the job. Um, one for traffic control, uh, my St. John's first aid ambulance, uh, first aid certification. Um, on the top here, my health card, just in case I'm injured or I need to get something done uh, medically, right? You should always have your health card on you. Uh, got my Smart Surf card for when we're at a licensed event. And then I have these flipped around, but these are my driver's license and my security license. Um, as mentioned, this window here for the ID has this thumb groove here so that you can pull your that ID out quick if you need to. So. That's pretty cool. And then again, you got the lanyard loop. So if I want to carry this around my neck, I can. And then that way my ID is present in the front, which usually I have the security license showing at all times there. So yeah, really nice wallet. As I mentioned before, when I have this wallet inside my back pocket, I like I sometimes don't realize I have it there. Um, it does fit in the front pocket as well. Now that I have everything in there, uh, let's just fold this wallet up and you'll see this has nothing in it and this is still slimmer than this wallet. And as mentioned, this with everything that I just showed you is 97 grams while this empty is 90 grams. So yeah, um, part of the reason why I also want to do this video is just that no one showed this wallet with the lanyard one and the zipper. And uh, I just figured that some people might be interested in this, especially people that do security or some form of uh, job that you need to have your ID present on the front of you. So I hope you liked this video. Uh, please subscribe to my channel. Uh, if you have any questions, leave them down in the comments below. Have a great day. Have a great week and take care.